Alright, welcome back to Globe Sweeper Hex Puzzler. Today we'll take a look at Dodecahedron, a level that I kind of put off for a bit because I was confusing it with its older and much meaner cousin, Icosahedron, which is probably one of the hardest levels in the game, but this one isn't too bad, though it does have a couple of uh, tricky bits. So let's just jump into it. And this, I believe, is the first level that has both min chains and max chain tiles. So you have to be careful about that. Don't get confused by which way the the mouth is facing, the Pac-Man mouth or whatever. But yeah, to start this one, we have a three group here. I, I feel like for many of these concepts, I probably don't need to explain them too thoroughly because at this point you really should know how to deal with tiles like this because you've probably seen this in the past. But since we have a three group, we have to make three separate groups, three separate tiles, and we have one tile here. If we were to add this tile, then it's not a separate tile, it's still one group. So, our first, if we just go in a clockwise manner, the first tile we can add that is a separate group is this one, and that would make two. And then to add a third, we have to skip over one and add this one for the third. So, we have to get this configuration and then delete these tiles. And then we can... Uh, just start by going here, because this I know this is a dead end very quickly. Here we have a max 1 chain. This tile can't connect up to this one, or it would be 2, so this one is disconnected. And then we get 5 right here. So then let's go up here, this 2. I'm probably not going to explain most of the normal tiles. Once again, max 1, so these have to be disconnected. Probably going to like speed up some of these things. Max 1, we can disconnect this. Max 1, disconnect this. 2. Now max 1 means we can't connect this one. Again, things you should probably know by now, but we'll get into more explaining in the trickier sections of the levels. So, once again, same as before, we have a three group, we have to have this configuration to have three separate tiles. Now here, we have a min2 tile, so this tile has to be connected to at least one more, so we have to add this one for a two, and on this side we have to add this one for a two. And now we can't connect up this tile, or it would be a five instead of at least one two for this min two chain. So this one is disconnected. And then here we get a max one. So this tile is gone. Here we once again get a uh, min two. So this tile has to be marked. And now this tile can no longer be marked because if we were to mark that, then there's no longer any more space to make a separate two tile or two group. So this tile has to be removed, which gives us a three group again. Same configuration as before. And this tile is disconnected. And now, since we have this tile, we have to mark this one as well, because this is a min 2. Max 1 chain, we have to disconnect the tiles here. And then we get the 2, max 1, once again disconnect it. 3 group, once again, same as before. And now I think we can start by going up here. So here we have a max 2, we have one tile here, that's fine. But then in these 3 tiles here, we have to have one chain of 2. And the only way to do that is to use the center tile. If we were to disconnect the center tile, we can't have a two chain anymore. So this one has to be marked. And now we have our two chain. We can no longer add in this tile or it would be a three chain instead. So that's gone. Max one chain and a one tile. Two groups in three tiles means we have to use the two edge tiles. That's the only way to have them separated. A uh, max two chain, same as over here. We have to use the center tile here in this three because we have to, if, if it is disconnected, then we can't make a two chain. Really, probably don't need to explain that at this point. Here, max three, four tiles, we need to have a chain of three. That means these two center tiles both have to be marked. If we disconnect either of these two, we can no longer make a three chain in any way. So these two are marked regardless of whether this one would have been marked or not. And now we have our three chain already done, so this tile can't be marked or it would be a four chain. And then this 2, let's mark this one. This 5 cluster is now done, so just disconnect all of the tiles connected to it. And then I guess we'll go down here with this 4. And the 3 is done. And the 1, same thing here. A uh, max 3, 4 tiles. We have to mark the 2 here. And now the 3 is done, so this tile is gone. And this 2, let's mark this tile, which now again completes this 5 cluster. And all of the connecting tiles can be removed. And then we get that. Max 1 chain, disconnect this tile, 3 group, same as before, and this 2 is already complete, and the 3 is complete here. This 2 is done, and now this 
max two doesn't really matter. The max part, it's just it needs two tiles and we only have two tiles. So that's done. And four here. And now we can't do anything over here. So let's go up here instead. This two is done. And the three needs the these two. And that's as far as we can go here. So now let's go over here. Max one tile means we can't connect up this one. And then this five has to go over here. It only has one tile, so we have to mark two. And then we have to mark three. Now here we have a min one, so this three chain is fine. But we also need one separate single tile. And the only separate single tile we have available is right here. This one would still be connected to this chain. So this tile has to be marked. And now we have to disconnect this one to preserve the, uh, the one tile here. And then here, once again, we get a max 2 chain, and in 3 tiles we have to mark the center tile for that 2 chain. And then disconnect this, because this is now done, and this 2 needs this tile, which now again completes this 5 cluster, and we can disconnect these tiles. We get the 3 here, completing this 2. And then here, max 1 chain, we can disconnect that. Min 2 means we have to mark this one, and once again, we have to disconnect this tile, or we can't make another separate 2 chain without it being connected up to this tile. So that one is removed. And now here, max two chain. Once again, three tiles. We have to have a two chain in here. So the center tile has to be marked. But now we can't do anything over here. This is actually probably going to be the last thing we do in this uh, this level. This one in this little area is a little tricky. So we'll get back to that. We get the two here. Max one chain. Disconnect that. And the two. Two groups and three tiles. We have to use these two edges. And once again, max 2 in 3 tiles, the center has to be marked. And here, min 2, we have one tile, we have to mark this one. And now we can't add another one, because then we can't make another 2 chain. So that's gone. And now this is also gone, because we can't make it a 2 chain at all. And the 0 there, max 1 chain, we can disconnect this tile. And this is marked, max 1 chain, max 1 chain. And this 2, max 1 chain. You know the drill, 3 groups here. Max one, three groups, and then here, this is a little tricky. So here, we have a max two with two of these. That doesn't mean they have to connect up here or here. One of them might and the other might not, or well, will not, because uh, having a single tile is fine here, but we do need at least one two chain somewhere here. And this tile is the key here. This tile in the middle cannot be marked, because if we were to mark this tile, then how do we make a 2 chain? This can no longer be a 2 chain, if it goes here, then it would be connected up to this tile as well, and we would have a 3 and a 1. If this tile is marked, then we get a 3 and a 1 there, and this tile on its own can't make a 2 chain in these 3 tiles. So this middle tile cannot be marked, we can remove it. That gives us a 1, and because we know we need a 2 chain here, or a 2 chain here, one of these tiles will be marked, completing this one, so these two tiles are removed. And then here we get a max 4, but the max part doesn't matter, we just need 4 tiles, and that's now done. And then we get the 4 here as well. So that's all we can do here, we have to go down, max 1 chain, min 3, so we have 1, 2, and 3, and similar to the 2 before, we now can't use either of these tiles, because if we add this one we can't fit another 3 in, and then this tile has to be disconnected because we can't fit a 3 in here. Two groups in three tiles, so that has to be marked. Max one chain, and this two. And now here's a little tricky section compared to uh, most of the level. So we have this two cluster here that will need one of these two tiles, which means this tile that is connecting both of them, or connected to both of them, cannot be marked. If we mark this tile, then this two has to become a three cluster in either way. So this tile is deleted. But now, we also have this two group. We already have two groups, so that's fine. But what would happen if we add either of these two tiles? So, if we add this one, that's fine. We still have two groups, and this two cluster would be, would be uh, satisfied. But what if we add this tile? If this tile is added, we now have three groups, which means we have to connect up this tile as well to make only two groups for this two. But if we connect up both of these, then this two cluster will then have three tiles. So this tile cannot be marked, or this would become a three cluster. So we can delete that tile. 
Uh, now, now we look at this uh, min two. So with this min two, if we add any tile here, they have to be connected to a two chain. So if you add this tile, for example, then we have to connect this one up as well to make a two chain. If we look on the opposite side, what happens if this tile is marked? If this tile would be marked for this min two, we would have to mark this tile as well, which again would make a three cluster for this two cluster. So this tile cannot be marked, we have to disconnect it. And that now gives us this tile for the two cluster, and we can disconnect it from the other tiles. And we get that, this two is now done. We get this here, I think we should maybe go up here, so two, it needs two tiles, doesn't matter that it's a, a min at this point. And the ones, max one, so disconnect it. One group, we already have one group. These two tiles are both separate, so they can't be marked. Two groups in three tiles, once again, cut the center out. Max one chain, have to disconnect that, max one chain. And same thing here, max two in three tiles, the center has to be marked. And now we have a two cluster here that can't connect up to either of these two tiles, or it would connect up to more tiles than it, it can be or can, can have. So these tiles are disconnected, this two is done, and this three is done, and this two cluster is now done. Uh, then here, once again, we need a two chain in these three tiles, so the center has to be marked. Now we get a two cluster, and we already know it will have this tile or this tile for this max two, so these three tiles will be disconnected regardless. And that now gives us the two here, completing this cluster, and then this three, and the two here is done. Max one, we have to disconnect this tile, and this four. Max one, we have to disconnect this tile. Min two, we have to add this tile for a minimum of two, and then we can't add this tile, and we can't add this tile, as we've seen before. That's as far as we can go here, and here, so now we have to find another place. Right here, we need two tiles for this two. Here we need min 3, so 1, 2, 3, and then this tile has to be disconnected to preserve the 3. Here we need max 3, but it doesn't really matter, it's the same thing. 4 tiles, we have to use the 2 center tiles, and that makes the 3 chain, so this tile has to be disconnected. And now this 6 cluster is already done, so disconnect all of the connecting tiles. And then, uh, I don't know which way is better to go, uh, doesn't really matter, I guess let's go up, so the 3 here. Main two, we have one, have to add two, and then disconnect it, and then disconnect this single tile as well. Two groups and three tiles, we've seen that before. Max one. And then here, max two chain, we don't have a two chain, and this is the only possible configuration for the two chain. Uh, main two, we have one, we have to add two, we have one, we have to add two, and then we have to disconnect the center. And once again, three tiles, we have to make a two chain, center has to be marked. Max 1, that's disconnected. 4 here. Max 1, that's disconnected. Min 2, we get 1 and then 2. And once again, that's disconnected and this is removed. And the 0 here. Once again, we get 3 tiles, 2 groups, so this has to be marked. And that tile is removed. Max 1 chain, that is removed as we've seen. Min 2, so 1 and 2. And like we've seen before, this tile now can't be marked. We can remove that. And we get a 3 group here. And then this tile now has to mark this one as well for the min two. Uh, yeah, I think I said max two, sorry. Again, I'm, I'm getting confused by these max and mins myself. Uh, and now here, we have a max three tile. So within this area, we need a three tile or a three chain. And since we have five tiles, that means we have to use the center tile here. If we were to remove this tile, then we can only have a two chain here and a two chain here. There's no longer any uh, possibility to make a three chain. So the center tile has to be marked. And that gives us a three cluster. Now, if this tile is marked, we know one of these has to be marked to make a three chain here. If this tile is marked, then this three cluster would connect up to four tiles. So that's not possible. This one has to be disconnected. And this has to be the one for our uh, max three chain. And now the three cluster is done, so all of these have to be disconnected. We get three groups here. The two is done, and the one. Two groups again. Max one, max one. 
normal one, these two, and the one, max one, max one, disconnect all of the single tiles, max one, max one, max one, you know, <laughs> it's the same thing the entire time. And here, we need a max two chain in three tiles, so the center has to be marked. Once again, giving us a two cluster that can't connect up to either of these tiles or connects up to this whole line. So these are gone. We get this tile for the four and the two is now done. And then this tile. Now we go down over here. This tile needs, uh, the, the two needs this tile. And here we have a uh, min one with a two chain. Now we have a one, so we have to disconnect this tile to preserve the one for this min one. And then a max one chain, we have to disconnect that. And here this five now needs to go to two and then three. And like we've seen, I think we saw this previously, uh, we now have to mark this tile because this min one has a three chain. We have to have a single separate one tile. And this is the only possibility to use uh, to do that. So this is marked and this has to be disconnected. Max one chain means we have to disconnect this tile. Uh, and then here, we can't say anything right now, but this five cluster has to go on this way for four tiles. And now the uh, max two already has two here, so this tile has to be disconnected. And then in this area, this max two has only the uh, possibility to have a two chain in these three tiles. So once again, the center tile has to be marked and then disconnected. And this five cluster is now completely done, so disconnected from everything. Uh, we'll wait with this one. We can solve this now, but let's let's do it later because that's like a pretty tricky area. So then we get the three here. And this is done. I'm just looking at the time. This might be a, a single video thing. Yeah, I guess so. I This is not a super hard level, but I guess it just takes a while to explain everything and go through. Min two, we have one and two, and this has to be disconnected. And this can't be marked or it's not min two. And then four tiles here. The min part doesn't really matter. Max one chain, this has to be disconnected. And uh, can we continue here right now? Well, we, we have to, yeah. So three, four, five, six. This has to go here for seven and then has to go here for eight. This three is now done. I think I confused this for a different section. And here, once again, three tiles, we have to make a two chain. So the center has to be marked. And this one, yeah, here we go. This is what I was thinking of. So here, now we have three, six, nine. So we only have one more tile out of these two for this 10 cluster. So on this three, we need to add two more tiles here. In other words, we need to disconnect one tile. What would happen if we disconnect this tile? Then we have to mark these two tiles and that gives two more tiles to the 10, giving it 11 instead of 10. So this tile cannot be disconnected. We have to mark this tile. And that is a one cluster, meaning it's already complete, so we have to disconnect all the surrounding tiles. And then this one is already done. The two here, max one, so this is disconnected. Max one, so these are disconnected. And then this tile for the four. The three here, that now completes this ten cluster, so these tiles are removed. This two needs these two tiles. And this four needs to go down here for three tiles. And this max two uh, tile has a two chain. Sorry, I'm like completely just, <laughs> all this terminology is getting to my head. So we have a two chain, this has to be disconnected, but we could still have another tile here, so we don't know that yet. But this four now has to have this tile. And then we can't connect up this. I mean, the four is done, so we have to disconnect this tile. And now, uh, we just look over here, this four needs these two, the three is now done. Min two, so we have one and then two, and then this has to be disconnected, and this has to be disconnected because it can't be part of a two chain. And then these two for the four, this three is now done, and this tile is now marked. So there we go, now we're completely done except for this final area here. And this final area here, we have a six cluster. And how many tiles do we even have? We have one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. So there's only one tile that has to be removed. But if we look at this min two tile, we have a two group already, but if we add any of these tiles, we have to add both, or either of these tiles, we have to add both. So it's, uh, there are only two options. Either we mark both of these tiles or we remove both of these tiles. 
What happens if we remove both of these tiles? If both of these are removed, then the 6 only has 5 tiles remaining. So that's not possible. We have to mark both of these tiles for this min 2. And that now completes this max 2. Here we have a 2 chain, so this tile has to be removed. And because we removed one tile, this 6 now only has 6 potential tiles remaining. So there we go. Yeah, I guess that has to be its own video, even though, uh, as I said, I don't think it's a particularly hard level. It's just, I guess, kind of uh, time consuming and takes a bit to explain. So I guess we'll leave it there. And yeah, I was planning on doing uh, assemble and up and down. I think both of these are relatively simple. Should be able to do those in one video, I would imagine. So we'll see about that next time. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. I'll see you then. Bye-bye.